the land of beautiful waters. Things are really looking great. I really do. I think Conacy is at a verge of exploding. Conacy should really become and should be and will become the Central Park of the South. I'm sincere about that. Destination Conesty. The real story, I think, is about Conesty's potential as a community. Well, what struck me first about this community is just the unlimited potential that exists here, mainly due to the natural beauty and the natural resources. Um, the Conesty Foundation is a 400-acre nature park. Um, you have multiple trails, over uh, 14 miles of trails within the park. Uh, the Swamp Rabbit Regional Greenway System comes through the park, and this is going to be basically the southern terminus of the Swamp Rabbit Trail in the short term. When I travel up to uh, Traveler's Rest and see what, what they were able to accomplish, I think the same thing could be accomplished right here. The opportunity I speak of, of course, is we can see in Traveler's Rest, and why reinvent the wheel? Conesty is very strategically located geographically in the county. It's one of the places that you look at the map, you see its proximity to large employment centers at XCTAC. Uh, you see its proximity to recreational resources. It's sandwiched in between the city of Greenville and the city of Malden. So it's got great access. And our role here is to try to make the connections, to try to bring people together and make the connections and encourage the revitalization of this great community. It's been a joy to see the community get involved our area churches um, and, and folks within the community coming together in a community redevelopment effort sponsored by the county. We put up the signs welcoming people to Conacy at both ends of the community. We assisted in putting up the historic marker for the McVee Chapel. The tree planting, you know, we planted over 90 trees. We can develop this into a park and actually tie in with the old ballpark. I think we have to look at the greater plan and see what that which we could tie together. I know when I looked at this 40 years ago, I thought what the Lord put here is absolutely gorgeous. Now mankind sort of botched it up a little, but I think working as partners, we could develop something very beautiful. All the things that we've accomplished so far would not be possible without our partners. Uh, Belmont Fire Station, SC TAC, local business owners, local churches, uh, Greenville Rec, so uh, the SCDOT. Uh, all of those partners really help make it possible. And moving into the future, uh, I believe that uh, it's important to keep engaged uh, with all of our partners and to continue the positive momentum that we've started.